Hi everyone, for today's video, I have a fun project to share. So I picked up these letter trays at Hobby Lobby and they're about, I'd say they're about 16 inches. And it's a really thin like chipboard and it's, um, let's see here, here it is. It's letter tray, so it's about 16 inches. And it's $4.99, which is an amazing price for this. And I thought this would be a great way to give some embellishments, All right? So we're gonna um, put together this one that I made. So here, this is um, actually this is for my mom, and so I get I picked up M for mom, and you can see I, I went ahead and added the design paper from Garden Party. Now, of course, I don't have paper that's 16 inches so what I did was I just you could see in the middle here you could barely see it but I just measured it and then I just made it even the strip on both sides so it's evened out and then I just did the rest as you can see and I love how it turned out so what I'm making for my mom my mom always loves um, when I'm pre-make her some cards or gift cards that she can give throughout the year to all her grandkids and her kids. So I thought this would be a cute way to gift my mom um, a kit and I'll put one together so my mom has an idea of how to put it together. But I mean, I'll show her anyway, but I thought it'd be fun to um, put this together. So this is, again, this is the letter M and I pre-made some shred. I love using my Daiso shredder and the crepe paper, the party streamer that I purchased at any of my um, craft stores or Dollar Tree stores. And I mixed it up with um, some of the crinkle paper that I you know, pre-buy. Okay, so what I'm gonna do first is I'm just gonna grab some and then I'm gonna fill up the letter like so. And so you can do this for um, any occasion, which would be really fun. You could do it for a birthday, you know, any holiday would be cute. But you know, us crafters, we love embellishments. And so if you're going to like a meetup or a crop and you're gonna meet some of your crafty friends. I thought this would be a cute way to gift them some embellishments. And then when they're done with the embellishments, they can, you know, display this in the room. So you can even add paper in the inside if you'd like. That would look really cute as well. So I'm just filling it up with some of this shred. Good. All right. Okay, so that should be good. And then I have this little container. I got some of these hearts that I picked up from Daiso and some of these uh, little gold glitter balls that I picked up from my Dollar Tree. And I mixed some of this pink flower sequence would be cute to add inside. Maybe I'll just do a little for now and then I'll fill it up towards the end. Oops. Okay, so I'll fill up the rest towards the end. Just make it even over there. Okay, so what I made was, let's see here, I got my tray here. So this is my tray of all my goodies and I'm going to fill it the letter with. Okay. So basically what I'm going to make my mom, let me set aside this rule for a second, is this gift bag. So this is a bag topper from KS Craft. And then I got these three by four clear bags. 
I'm also going to add a flare button that says happy birthday. And then these cute little butterflies from one of the new dies, um, which is this one that I picked up from Hobby Lobby. And then this is an oldie but goodie gift card holder from Hobby Lobby by Momenta. And that's gonna be these little cards. So what my mom is gonna basically do is put the gift card in here and then she can add the butterfly to seal it, which I did add some glue dots for her. And then she's gonna put it in the clear bag like so. I'm giving, gifting her a bottle of these diamond dots that she could fill up a little diamond dots in the bag. And then I make pre-made some rosettes for her. So once she puts the bag topper on top like so, she could add the rosette just like that. And then the cute little flare button on top. So it's gonna look like that by the time she's done. Okay, so we're gonna pack this letter up. Just wanted to give you guys an idea what this embellishment holder is holding. Okay, so first I'm gonna add to the rosettes. I use my favorite Tim Holtz rosette die. I love that die. So I pre-made, and this is all garden party collection, by the way. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just going to, I'm gonna do it this way so you guys can see it. Cause it's a pretty long letter. So I'm just gonna add it like this. So I'm just gonna fill this up with the rosettes. Just make it nice and pretty. Okay, so she's got her rosettes there. And then I'm gonna add the glue dots, which I'm gonna give her a little bit more because so she can glue down her bag topper. But I did add, so I basically made a dozen for her. Um, and then I'm gonna add the clear bags right here for her. And then the glue dot, just do that. And then I made the bag toppers so there's 12 of them in all the different design papers. And then I just wrapped it with some pink twine. So I'm just gonna present it like that. Thank you. And then in this container, which I had shared, this is one of those cute little containers that you could pick up and you know, at your local Dollar Tree, or I picked these one up actually from Hobby Lobby. And I just added some pre-made one inch happy birthday flare buttons that she will put on top of the rosettes. So I'm gonna place that back in the center here. Okay. And then these are the little envelopes. So there's about a dozen in there. I just made a belly band to hold it together and then I just placed a rosette and a little vellum bird from the collection. I think I'll do it like that. Okay, and then these are the butterflies that you can add onto the envelope. So there's 12 that are pre-cut. And then here's a bottle of her diamond dots, which I add a cute little flare on the top of the lid make it a little extra cute. And then I just pre-cut some of these butterflies, you know, just to put it on the box. And then these are some bows that I pre-made prior using um, KS Crafts bow dye. And if she wants, let's see, my mom can add that. instead of the rosette. Well, actually, no, she can add these to the envelopes. I think it will be cute. So I put that there. I'm gonna kind of just layer it like so. 
so make quite a few. So yeah, so this would be a cute way to let me take this one out. Cute way to give somebody some embellishments. So it's like four there. And yeah, so that is the cute letter M. And then I'll add the rest of this stuff inside just to fill it up. And I thought it'd be a cute way to gift I just love the letter. So I've got some gold sequins here too. Yeah, so that is my project share that I wanted to share with you guys. I thought it was a super cute way to give somebody. And I bought the letters for my girls so I can make one for each of their birthdays. And then I could fill it up with the stuff that they're into or the things that they like. All right. Thanks for watching. Again, I picked this up at my local Hobby Lobby. Bye.